Check this out. Six inches of snow here on Saturday on Seymour. We're getting ready for the Spartan race on June 14th. Coming up, tips on how to master the eight foot wall. Do it, people. All that and more coming up. I guess I gotta do this too. Mandy, we're getting ready. Mandy Gill, fitness instructor. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> now, usually for the Spartan race, which is June 14th, people are uh, dressed in, uh, you know, barely anything because it's it's June. Exactly. Now, for the purposes of today, we're well, dressing down, but we should actually be having, you know, We should be keeping clothes. these people a little bit warmer yeah. than we actually so, are. <laughs> between takes, we are uh, getting warm. Yes, but absolutely. This, this is the eight-foot wall part of the Spartan race, right? Yes. So this is a lot of times when people come up and see when they're, like, completely exhausted during the race. Yeah. And all of a sudden, they're like, how in the world am I going to get over this? How would you even start to tackle it? So basically, thankfully, we've brought some people very well dressed out here okay, today. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to show you basically what we would do for a gentleman. So okay. I'm going to pull you up, Pete and Terry. Wonderful. So for guys, you're going to run. You're going to approach the wall. Yep. You're going to do much of like a push up. Go ahead, Petey. Okay. Now this is just training for the wall before you actually tackle it. So this is basically a technique that you would use okay, in order okay. to get over it pretty easily. So grab the top and sort of run up the, up the straightaway of it. You got it. Okay. And when you're getting over it. the other side, really make sure that you're not just kind of like bailing over the other side. Okay. Risk of injury, of course. And how right? about for the ladies? So for the ladies, what we're actually going to do a little bit differently is we're going to get a boost. So we'll get one of the girls over here. Okay. Wonderful. Awesome. Perfect. So the foot goes in the hand. Nice. These Helping kind of hand. events are all about, you know what I mean? Exactly. Yeah. Getting yeah. help from others. Some teamwork. Exactly. So basically to train for things like this, um, th uh, stuff you can do is like dips on the bench in the park. Okay. You can be doing push-ups. You can be doing pull-ups. Find some monkey bars anywhere. Stuff along those lines. Great tips. Let's uh, get going here. Perfect. And uh, we'll, we'll all try one. Okay. Let's go. All right, guys. We're uh, getting ready for the Spartan race, which is going on Seymour. Michelle, June oh, 14th. Time. I will tackle the the ladies' side for now. You know, some of the ladies are doing the men's side, though, aren't they? Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! There we go. <laughs> nice and easy. Nicely done. You know it, Michelle. We're getting ready for the Spartan race on June 14th. We're here at Seymour. A little bit of snow on the ground, but that's okay. We're dressed for June attire. Coming up, we are going to learn how to tackle the balance beam, which is part of the Spartan race. Stick around. Don't go anywhere. Yeah! Yeah, just put it on the sunscreen here on Seymour, people. <laughs> Woo! Six inches of snow on Saturday. Mandy Gill here, fitness Woo! instructor extraordinaire. Yeah, it's hot. Getting ready for the Spartan <laughs> race on June 14th. Uh, we are dressed as how people would be participating in the Spartan race. Absolutely. But off camera, we are keeping warm. Yes, no we, hypothermia today. We, we don't want to seize up. <laughs> the balance beam is part of the uh, Spartan race. It is Pretty a very self popular one. Self-explanatory. Yes. But what are some uh, good uh, training tips to get okay, ready for Okay, this one you want to be very serious about making sure that you've got this one right, because if you do fall off, it's 30 burpees. Nobody oh, wants to be doing 30 burpees. Oh my goodness. I know, so let's talk great ways to train for an exercise like this. All right. So basically what we're gonna look at first is just a simple squat, okay? okay? So both feet on the ground, about shoulder width apart, a little bit out from there, way down your heels, coming down into a nice squat. Awesome boys, I'm gonna let you do this. Perfect, knees out over your toes, wonderful. So that is a great way to incorporate into your training. Right. Another great idea too is pistol squats. Pistol squats. Okay, so that just means you're on one leg. And we got Pistol Pete showing We got there. Pistol Pete, he's our man today. Do you wanna try this with him? I'll try it, now do, do you go it. all the way down? Yes, yeah, so all the way down, you're breaking parallel and you're going right back up. Yes! <laughs> we have not practiced this on a Those are tough. Right? Yeah, okay. So now what you would end up doing is you're moving this actually onto the balance beam. All right. So as you can see Samantha here doing, she's getting her grip. Well, okay, maybe not. <laughs> yeah, <And> so <laughs> practice makes perfect she's though. She's finding her way through. Yeah. And uh, when she gets to the corner, that's when you're rebalancing. All right, well, let's give it another shot. Now, something I will mention that's really important about something like this yeah. is making sure that you do have proper shoes on. This is going to help a lot with your traction. They're water um, and mud resilient. They're all-terrain shoes. So basically, when you're coming across something like this balance beam, yeah. they're really going to help with keeping your traction on there. All right, cool. You heard it. Tips from the pros, people. We're tackling the balance beam. Uh, Jody and Riaz here for the Spartan Race happening June 14th. Hopefully, there'll be less snow. Woo! That kicked think? out squat. We are impressed, Thor Cow. Wow. It's kind of hard. I, my form needs work, though. But you didn't even try that off camera. That is amazing. <laughs> All right, Mandy, come back in. June 14th, Spartan Race here at Seymour. And yes. this is the 
Over, under, through. You got it! Okay, what yes. is the training for this? You know what, you guys go ahead. I know you want to keep warm. We're dressed like we go are in for June. It, guys. Yes, exactly. But, you we know, really between are. takes, we're, we're keeping warm. What's the so good training the technique? The over, for this under, one? through is going to be incorporating a lot of cardio into your workouts. Okay. Now, um, basically, you can start with running. You can start getting that kind of stuff going into your workouts, but also involve stuff like push ups. Get those going. Um, if you are starting out new to something like this, as you can see, Carla right there doing the under part. Oh dear. Um, that is gonna be a good push up part that's involved. And Phyllis is in no, the snow. No, Poor nobody girl. Wants to, nobody wants to touch the snow. <laughs> now, if you are starting out just doing something like push ups, start from your knees. It's not a problem at all. Okay. Now, uh, you can incorporate into the plank position. And a lot of this is just involving body weight movements. You know, and things like push ups, it's easy to do at home. You don't need equipment. It's super There's easy. There's not really an excuse not to do that kind no, of stuff. You can right? do them up against the wall if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. We got flailers everywhere. You know, we're having fun. My money's on four. We I also, think you got this. We also have to keep in mind that, um, you know, you don't want to hurt yourself either, right? No, and another great thing about this that you can help body-wise during a race course like this is compression pants. We've got one of our guys here in them as well. Compression pants. Okay, yes. I got gotcha. you. Compression pants. Ah, compression cold. shorts. Go, sword, go. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Hey, we got through it, you know. Woohoo! and Jody, back to you. <laughs> It's snowing on Seymour. <laughs> <laughs> yes, more, keep warm with leg kicks. Oh, that just nasty. stay on Thor. Or will you just make us happy on a Monday? Coming up, one more segment here at the Reebok Spartan Race. One of the things we'll be looking at is the tractor pull. You know what? This looks pretty easy. I can do it. Oh. Ah. Ah. There you go. Stick around. All right, one final segment here, the Reebok Spartan Race on June 14th. Now, Mandy, uh, we're dressed obviously for June. It's a little cold up here today, but what's the important thing to remember about attire on that day, on Spartan Day? Absolutely no cotton whatsoever. No cotton. What you really want is something like a synthetic whipping, wicking fabric. Okay. Um, also along the compression line. Basically, that's gonna help with muscle fatigue. It's gonna help so that you don't get weighed down, that you know that the race doesn't turn into a wet t-shirt contest, really. Good stuff, and all right. wants that. At some point, you will get these sandbags on the race, and what yes. do you have to do with them? So basically, with this sand base what we're really looking for is stabilization these are going to come up during the race when you're running up a hill and you are absolutely exhausted all right so at home what we can do is we can be training with these yep. by doing burpees all right everyone loves burpees Yay. so get your sand bag down to the ground chest to the ground jump back up and you're waving this thing above your head yeah. there we go all right one's enough for what? me come on hundred <laughs> okay we track and pull now Okay, how can you pulls. train for the tractor pull? Because you'll get this at some point on the race as well. Absolutely. Okay, you so will. you got some weights so, here. Weights here. Basically, the idea is you want to. Oh dear. There we go. You want to get used to the fact of something <laughs> heavy and yep. being like a dead weight in your hands. Okay. Okay. So grab some soup cans out of the closet at home. Sure. All you want to do is walk around with them. You can do some basic lunges. Okay, so just really getting used to the idea of having heavy weights in your hands. And those are nice two 20 pounders each, right? Yes. So the idea is you want to kind of sling it over here like this, right? You got it. And, and you want to go. Her. You want to keep that momentum going. No! <laughs> Well done. All right, guys, June 14th, go to the website, Spartan, Reebok Spartan Race. There's two races, actually, one for, uh, you know, people that aren't quite inclined to do the, the whole thing, right? You got it. There's a sprint, there's a beast, and just different kilometers. That's all that there is. Regardless, you're going to have a riot. Dress properly. <laughs> you don't necessarily need to see snow, but it'll be, it'll be fun. Bam! All right, people, let's storm the wall one more time. Woo! Go to the website for details, June 14th, Reebok Spartan Race. <laughs>